Hey guys, what's up? This is Ivobotastic, and I am going to bring you another video. Today, I'm actually going to do a mod review on Optifine, and I know that sounds weird because a lot of people have done that, but um, I've been getting questions on how to make my Minecraft faster, and people always ask me because their Minecraft FPS is slow, and they say they want to play, but they can't, and so what is the easiest, most possible way to do this? And it's actually like so simple. I've made a video on how to make your Minecraft faster before. I can um, put that down. This is more of a review and like a spotlight. So, first of all, Optifine, all it does is add some settings first off, and then it'll improve your FPS immediately. So, when you log in, you'll definitely notice a change in, um, in FPS. But if I go to options, you're going to notice some new settings. So, if I go to video settings, there's a lot more settings. So first I have graphics. Um, right now it's on fast. But um, you'll start out on fancy and that's going to be kind of slow. You're going to notice um, if you don't have a decent graphics card. So t to make that a little bit faster you can change your fancy to fast. Um, render distance it actually goes all the way to extreme for massive GFX people. But um, this is on far. And if I want to change it to normal I can set it down and then it's on normal and the lower you go down obviously the faster it's gonna be now performance it starts on I have no idea but you're gonna change it to max FPS because that's the fastest and then you have view bobbing right here advanced open GL GUI scale um, leave all this stuff right here chunk loading I take leave that on default this is actually a version that includes some different version or er, versions different um, little options here so you got multi-core which is for stable FPS, blah 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 blah. I leave it on default just because your fog start, you can mess with this to kind of, I don't know, choose where your fog starts and it doesn't affect the performance. So, yeah, you can leave it on 0.2, but the farce it goes is 0.8. Uh, fog, fast is faster fog, off, no fog, and that's the fastest. So, I'm going to leave that there. And then details clouds default okay this is cool I can turn off trees or I can take trees to lower quality to make them faster I can put everything on loader lower lower, ugh, lower quality so um clouds fast if I want to rain and snow snars okay I just said snars um excuse me I just got done playing a lot of DayZ quality uh we have swamp colors custom fonts you can change any of this there's so much Texture packs is actually kind of cool. You can change your texture pack right from here. And it also patches them to be HD, so you don't have to do any HD patches anymore. And, um, yeah, it's not got specs or specs or however you say it. And then other lagometer, um, it kind of shows your lag, weather, full screen, server textures, blah, blah, blah. But, um, yeah, this should immensely increase your game. Ha! <laughs> like how that just was okay yeah anyways this will increase your game and um, hopefully it'll let you play faster and now I'm gonna go in how to install it because you guys deserve to know how to install Optifine so uh, see you so guys the first thing you want to do is go on to the link that is in the description and it'll bring you to the Optifine website so at the time I'm making this video there is different versions and standard is actually only for 1.3.2 but uh, you can get that for 1.4.2 probably sometime in a few days or next week. But for now, I'm going to grab the Ultra version. So what you want to do is open up your Minecraft. And then you're going to go to Options. And you're going to push Force Update. And just ignore that. Push Login. And it'll reset your bin basically without you having to do it. And you're just going to wait for that to do it. So um, next, while that's doing that, you can go to Ultra or Standard, depending on which one's there. But right now it's Ultra. I recommend Standard for all people, not many conflicts. I'm going to go to Download, and then I'm going to open the link in New Tab, because that's what I do. It's going to bring you to AdFly, and you're just going to wait five seconds. And then I'm going to go two, one, OK. You're going to go to Skip Ad, and Bear, Bear. There you go. Download Optifine. And uh, you can go to downloads, save, and there it is right there. You can just open it up, 
the, by clicking on it and you need to have WinRAR installed. If you don't have WinRAR, I'm going to put it in the description. Um, but there it is right here, WinRAR. And to open it, you can use any program, but uh, I recommend Win WinRAR. So here it is. And then Minecraft is done. So you're going to go to your start menu, type in run. And there it is right there, run. Open that up and type in percent app data percent push ok go to dot minecraft go to bin then open up minecraft and if it's not like the little books next to it you're gonna right click push open with and then if it's not still with winrar isn't here still push choose default program you're gonna click on winrar and if it's still not there you can browse for it i don't know where it is but it's in there somewhere and you're gonna click on winrar and there it is so next you just push close on this little ad thing if you get that. You won't get it in the first 30 days. I'm going to go over to Optifine and drag everything from Optifine right into Minecraft.jar. And I can go to meta.inf and delete that. You have to delete meta.inf. So once I delete that, it'll be all good. I can log into my Minecraft. Boop. Logging in. And everything will be good. So you should just get the screen. You can automatically do it. Thanks for watching my videos, guys. And um, as always, please rate, comment, subscribe. Do all your good business. And I will see you next video.